let's look at what Russia's nuclear doctrine in fact states. The Russia's nuclear doctrine states that Russia will only use a nuclear weapon under one condition. If another state were to provoke an attack with a weapon of mass destruction, but the decree stating this ends with a caveat. It goes on to state that nuclear weapons will be used in case of aggression against the Russian Federation with the use of conventional weapons when the very existence of the Russian state is under threat. This is the condition under which Russia, as part of its nuclear doctrine, will use a nuclear weapon. Now what makes this dangerous is a statement that Vladimir Putin has made after he invaded Ukraine. He said, and I quote him here, For our country it's a matter of life and death, a matter of our historical future as a nation. It is not only a very real threat to our interests, but also to the very existence of the Russian state and to Russia's sovereignty. But at the tactical level, however, the situation is completely different. There is a doctrine in place of no first use. But because Russia's wording and intentions at this moment are pretty difficult to gauge, these kinds of statements, of course, call for a lot of concerns around the world. Now, the threat of a nuclear weapon has surfaced multiple times in the last 18 odd months of the war. The problem is that just because Putin has not pressed the red button in the past, that does not mean that he will not press it in the future. But what makes all of this extremely concerning is that because as the war continues to drag on, it has made both parties much more desperate in trying to achieve a victory. And that is what makes these kind of statements extremely concerning.